up y'all welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in once again those of you who do not know i'm neat natural it's n-i-q-e-n-a-t-u-r-a-l-t-m if y'all enjoy this look we got some cut crease action i'm over here looking like money green and gold okay take that take that yeah i'll take that like diddy so i'm over here looking like oh you know what i'm saying all good and everything hold on You ain't catching me slipping. Okay. So I enjoyed this look. Let me tell y'all, this look uh, was giving me a fit at first. I was doing this on Facebook Live. Neat Natural TM, the beauty and makeup artist. That's the plug. I just slopped this on here, to be honest. I'm taking this concealer. I'm taking this little small brush and I'm just putting this on here. I'm not so clean when it comes to this part. It's okay because a lot of people aren't, but I'm not anyway. And I ain't gonna lie to you. Just taking this and I'm patting this in. I'm patting softly because I want this to have a nice consistency. Like so. Patting, patting, patting. Pat, pat, pat. This in. From the Vitality palette, Vitality palette right here, and I'm just pressing that. And I think I may set it with this. How about that? I'm gonna set it with this because I don't be having all those expensive setting powders. I don't. I'm gonna take this yellow right here from the Reloaded Iconic Division palette from Makeup Revolution. I'm gonna take this fluffy brush. to do the pack and then sweeping method because I just feel like when you sweeping too much you're not really picking up a lot of product but take that yellow and pack it like this here oh that's looking good so that is my transition shade I don't like waiting on shipping maybe you have to ask do you want overnight do you want expedited shipping no I just want regular shipping because I didn't already pay that much for the palette just give me regular shipping and then it's just like I hate sitting there and waiting has it arrived yet is it eight o'clock yet okay it's in my area when will it be here when when will it be here? Oh my God. All right, so it's in my area. What time are you coming? I hate that. I hate that. I be on pins and needles. If you want to send me something, send it to me. But please inbox me when you know it's already at the post office, at the P.O. box. I'll be like, okay. I love stuff like that. But to sit here and wait, don't even send me the tracking number because it just really, I'm really just going, I'd rather be surprised. Like, who's that at the door? Oh, it's my package. I like stuff like that. I don't know. Can anybody else agree with me on that? Or do y'all like waiting? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to go into this, <laughs> this green right here. And I still haven't got over this cold. And this is going to be my next color. Oh, I hate waiting. Oh, my God. I just got teed off from thinking about it. <laughs> now, that's crazy. Let all that uncircumcised skin just fold down right there because, hey, it be getting all in the way. So you want to stretch it out and just, it looks a little, uh, I don't know if I'm going to keep this tutorial. Okay, so we're going to take this darker green right here and I'm just going to put this over that as well. All right, so I'm just going to blend this out like so and blend it right here as well too we're just taking this green you can see i'm just taking a divot right here just to make sure that this is very pigmented and vibrant so when i go back we're doing a halo right are we doing a cut crease what was i talking about oh my god and then we're just doing this little shape right here we're just putting that in the center that color is 33 years old now Y'all make me laugh. They are saying that a cold is symptoms of pregnancy, honey. Got me over here scared to cough. I know he would be the happiest man alive, though. Yeah, I've learned something there. Do the green first. Don't try to do all that other extra stuff. Just put the green now. Put the one that's going to be in the background down first. And I'm just basically fading that in all right and i'm just taking that dark green again and just blending that around like so uh that dark green and just make my little shape we don't want that to fade away if you get came up too high just take that dark green 
And now I'm just taking that gold and placing it right in the center with that mixing medium. I'm going to the Juvia's Place palette, this green. Now when it comes to this, I would say it's all about the pigment and brushes that you're using. Because I ain't gonna lie, my brushes right here are not meant for this stuff. It's, well, they, they've gotten a little worn. And you really just, when you bring out, when you do this uh, halo, you gonna need some brushes that ain't going that you ain't got to carry the whole way. I'm just gonna go ahead and make this like a little dome and I'm gonna go back and clean it up with a darker green. I'm gonna go back to that gold and just fix everything. It was looking a mess just a minute ago, but it's all about you still working with it and not giving up on it because it may be a problem that everyone can encounter. With makeup, sometimes it's unpredictable. Take this and go right here and darken that up. You see I took a smaller brush. Now I'm just taking it and going right here as well. Right here, I'm just cutting it off. I'm gonna take that green again and just blend that softly across there. kept working with it until I got it. I'm gonna go back into this Juvia's Place palette and add some yellow, cause I hate when my yellow fade away. Tap, tap. After I get away with it, once I'm in and out, I'm leaving it alone, you feel me? Cause I'm about scared to go back. Okay, in and out, just sneak in, add that little color in, and get out, honey. Get out while you can dust off this excess and you know what i think i'm gonna leave this gold on my face how about that i'm just gonna take my finger and blend this in because gold pigment being you know be that stuff that people put on their face prior to make a look to make their skin look like it's glowing so i'm just gonna leave it how about that yep i'm leaving it Maybelline Pore Eraser for my primer. Instant Fakes from Ruby Kisses. I know if I doubled up, I would have got the drama that I wanted. But I'm gonna put this on both my natural lash and the lash. And once I'm done, I like to go over my brows just because I like them to be a little darker. You don't have to do this. like to put like some dots all over the face now I'm going to just blend this in to the skin I like to press it and then like do a little circle of motion like stipple it and my brush is a little damp so I feel like that is helping y'all I'm feeling these eyes yep I'm feeling that I'm proud of these eyes cut crease game that came oh yes thank you lord yes mm -hmm. makeup revolution palette division palette and I'm going to this dark color, which is like a black. And just go up underneath and smudge that underneath my lash line. Do some smoky action right there. Also, I'm take that green, just do the ends right here to open up my eyes a little bit more. And I'm gonna take the back of this brush and I'm going into this makeup, I mean NYX white base. And I'm gonna take that same like fluffy brush that I had before and brush that upwards against my lashes in case anything got on my lashes. Highlight for Makeup Revolution. It is called Golden Lights. Get right up in here. Up in 
the bend right here on that brow bone. I like to place it first, and after I place it, I like to go back, taking my other brush, feather that in, but I'm not going as far up because I want a nice gradient effect. Look at me looking like a pretty chameleon over here. Crying gold over here. Okay. Like a golden goose. Oh, I'm going to use fun. So we just pressing, pressing, pressing. You see I'm dragging it down when it gets to my eye. I'm dragging it down because I do not want it to go overlap what I've already placed. And I'm just bringing that down, making a little dome shape with this. And some people do these steps all together. You can do it either way you feel like it's, you, you know, you're more comfortable with. My nose now, before that dry up, Take another brush and just this dry and just blend this all in. Taking this 355 and I'm setting this. I highlight my nose with that 355. And just highlighting this same area on top. like to use a smaller brush just to come up in areas I couldn't reach with my other brush I'm going to set everywhere on my face just to make a matte finish I'm just setting all the other areas on my face that's not highlighted pulling it back because I don't want it to come too far down and I'm just wiping down my brush each time before I go in just so it don't get muddy and I, I feel like I got a clean brush every time this is 360 and I'm just gonna take it and dab it right here you see it just got a nice grade and effect I'm gonna take this 360 and put it right here as well y'all let me know if this video was helpful and with this highlight from makeup revolution Blushing Rose. I'm taking my brush and just patting it on. I'm gonna take this color, pat this in the center because it looks like that'll be cute. On the highlight note, braid a brush again. Just taking that light pink again and just going over right here. I'm going to take the darker shade from Ruby Kisses and just go right here and just snatch my cheeks a little more. Wiping off my brush each time, add some blush. I'm going to go into this color right here again, what I use for my lips, and stip it up on my cheeks. First, I'm gonna spray my little brush. I like the mister on that. This is warm apple cider vinegar lip gloss. So I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Thank you again. Go ahead and comment, rate, and subscribe. Click that thumbs up button, please. Okay, comment. 
Yes, because I like to know what you think. I like to know what's on your mind. Okay, comment that down below. Let me know what videos you would like to see next. And also, don't forget to subscribe. Be a part of the Neat Natural fam. Don't be no stranger now. Don't be no stranger. And invite your friends to come. They can come. It's not one of those things where I'm going to be acting funny like, who you brought with you? No, I'm going to tell you, come on in, girl. Get you some lemonade. You know, sit down, have a seat, honey. Come on, when you've been on your feet all day, come on, sit down, girl. Let's talk. That's what y'all should think about whenever you come on to my channel. Just think about I am going to be using the whole like southern hospitality. I'm inviting you in. Close the door because you let my good air out. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead. Come in. Click that subscribe. Don't be no stranger. And I will see y'all later. Bye y'all. Wait. Hold on. Bye. I don't want to mess up my lip gloss. You know. Bye. Bye y'all.